Hi everyone, I'm Mani, the CEO and founder of Valor. If you earn an income in Maine, you know you'll lose income taxes to federal and Maine state taxes. But how much? It's important to understand your state's income taxes and how they will impact your financial future, not least because that knowledge will empower you to take action to reduce your tax bill today. In this video, we'll explain what the income tax is and how it is taxed in Maine. We'll also show you different tax planning strategies that can significantly reduce your federal and state income taxes, ranging from taking advantage of renewable energy incentives, tax advantaged accounts, leveraged charitable structures, and private placement life insurances. So let's get started. What is the income tax? Income taxes are taxes imposed on individuals or entities that earn ordinary income. Ordinary income refers to the income that you earn from your usual sources, like a paycheck from your job or profits from your small business. It's also the money you might get from things like rental income, dividends, interest, royalties, and even some retirement accounts. Think of ordinary income as the typical money you earn day in and day out. Unlike other types of income, such as long-term capital gains or qualified dividends, which can get preferential tax treatment, your ordinary income gets no special tax perks and typically has a higher tax rate. The amount of income tax a person or entity pays typically depends on their income level. The federal income tax and most state versions are progressive, which means that the share of your income that you will pay in taxes goes up as you earn more, though some states do levy a fixed percentage or flat income tax. In the United States, federal income taxes can range from 10 to 37% of a person's taxable income, and state taxes run from 0% to north of 13%. The amount of tax you owe each year is calculated based on your gross income, which includes wages, interest, dividends, and other earnings. Let's now walk through both types of income taxes. The federal income tax is a tax that the United States government levies on the annual earnings of individuals, corporations, trusts, and other legal entities. It's a portion of your income you must pay to the federal government to fund its operations. As an example, let's consider an individual whose taxable ordinary income is $350,000. This person falls into the 35% tax bracket. As a result of the progressive tax system, however, not every dollar they earn will be taxed at that rate, as the 35% bracket begins at around $244,000 of income. This means that the dollars the individual earns over that amount will be taxed at 35%, but dollars below that amount will be taxed at the rates corresponding to the different brackets they fall into. Adding the amounts together, the individual would pay a total of around $93,000 in federal income taxes for 2024, or an effective tax rate of around 27%. So, you now understand how federal income tax rates apply. What about Maine income taxes? The Maine state income tax is progressive, meaning the rate of taxation increases as taxable income increases. In other words, different portions of the individual's income are taxed at the different rates corresponding to the brackets they fall into. In 2024, the main state income tax rates range from 580 to 7.15%. Let's again consider an individual who has a taxable income of $350,000 in Maine. This person falls into the 7.15% tax bracket. Adding the amounts together, the individual would pay a total of around $24,500 in state income taxes for 2024, or an effective state tax rate of 7%. Taking into account both federal and state taxes, the individual would pay a total effective tax rate of around 33.6%. As you can see, income taxes are the primary tax most individuals face and are often their biggest annual cost. Accordingly, it's critical to identify strategies that can reduce this tax. Tax planning is a strategic approach designed to reduce a person's or a company's tax liability by leveraging various tax benefits and allowances. It's about understanding the tax implications of your financial decisions so you can minimize your taxes and ultimately keep more of your hard-earned money. This might involve making investments that offer tax benefits, choosing the right type of retirement account, taking advantage of deductions and credits, or investing in a tax-advantaged account. Several different tax planning strategies can help you reduce your income tax liability. Here are the four we consider most advantageous. Buying renewable energy projects. Investing in renewable energy projects can make you eligible for significant government tax incentives to lower your income taxes. Taking into account tax savings and income from the solar business, 
This strategy can make a 5.85 return on investment compared to choosing to pay your taxes directly instead. Maximize retirement contributions. Both federal and state tax laws allow deductions for contributions to certain retirement accounts, like a 401k or an IRA. Maxing out these contributions can lower your taxes, including ordinary income and capital gains taxes. If you are charitably inclined, a charitable lead annuity trust or CLAT might be an option to increase your charitable deductions this year and minimize your tax liability. As an example, if you have your money in a CLAT, you'll be able to take home 28% or more compared to not using one and paying your taxes up front and reinvesting the remainder in a regular taxable account. There are also other charitable and land conservation programs that can help you reduce your taxes and do good in the world as well. Finally, for ultra high net worth individuals, private placement life insurance or PPLI can be a good option to avoid income and capital gains taxes while providing insurance for your family. PPLI can often help families pass on more than 70% more assets to future generations. All right, that wraps it up. I really hope you enjoyed the video and learned something new. Please feel free to comment, share, and subscribe to our channel. Now, a quick word about Bala. We've built a platform to give everyone access to the tax planning tools of billionaires like Facebook founder Mark Zuckerberg and others. We make it simple and seamless to pick the best strategy, set up, and administer these structures at a fraction of the cost of competitors. I really hope you found this video useful. If you still have any questions, please visit our website at Balor, B-A-L-U-R.io, where you can read more content on the subjects, play with our online calculator to discover your potential financial gains, or schedule a call with us.